Hi guys, this is a quick video just to show you a solution for a previous issue that we had before. At the time I don't have a solution for it and we found an alternative solution at that time. The issue was if we need to modify this connection and we're trying just to change the parameters on this connection, this option here on 2019 was activated. On 2020 we couldn't find it activated to modify the options and the only one way around it we had at that time to go either edit type from here or edit properties from here or type properties and go duplicate the the uh, connection so we don't change the original one rename it and then edit from here that's the previous approach we had to solve this problem in order to get to this menu here to modify the parameters of the connection, the number of ports, location, plates, all of those parameters. Uh, having said that, the quicker solution and the better solution for this issues is to just simply, which is a new tick box they created on 2020, on Revit 2020 for some reason. Simply when you select this connection and you would like to modify the parameters, or when you create a new connection at any location and you want to adjust that connection for steel or what you have to do you select that connection instead of going straight away to here you have to tick this box override by instance when you tick this box give it a minute this button here will be modified and activated and now we can go and just do the standard changes without worrying about changing the original connection or what you'd be doing just changing this one particular connection okay so this is a quick solution for that issue so please whatever we did during our previous videos to change a connection with the longer not preferred way we said it at the time it wasn't preferred that was the only option I could find or solution I could find at that time due to the change they made to Revit 2020 Whenever we did that change by going to edit type or going here to type properties and then edit from there, please revise that and start using this text box here. This checkbox, just add a tick into this box here and that will activate your modified parameters. Thank you.